We have a special announcement. BISD is closing school on Thursday the 8th and Friday the 9th due to high levels of sickness. Everything will be back to regular schedule on Monday the 12th. The Junior High Valentine's Dance, which was scheduled for Friday the 9th, is moved to Friday the 16th from 6 to 9.30. Also, Ms. Edsel wants to remind parents to come lend a hand next Wednesday and 30, Thursday from 4 to 6 to help decorate. The softball scrimmage for Friday on the 9th is still on. The boys basketball game on Friday at Millsap is still on. The ACT for, scheduled for Saturday the 10th is still happening at 7.30 a.m. The UIL and solo ensemble contest is still on at Stephenville. And the baseball scrimmage at home for Saturday is still on. Now we will have our regular video announcements. Hello, welcome back to the online video announcements. We will be doing the week of February 12th through February 18th. On Monday, there is UIL academic team practice at 5 p.m. at the band hall. There's a school board meeting at 6.30, and there's a softball scrimmage at Albany, varsity only. On Tuesday, it is the beginning of the San Angelo Ag Mechanics Contest. NOAA Project comes to South during PE classes. There's an OAP clinic at 11.30 a.m. in Brownwood, Texas, and North goes to the Fort Worth Symphony Field Troop in Graham. There's a baseball scrimmage versus early at home. It is boys basketball senior night at home, and there's a PTO meeting at East at 5.30 p.m. On Wednesday, there's Valentine's parties at East. On Thursday, it is Healthy Heart Night at 5.30 p.m. at South Elementary, and there's a softball tournament in Jacksboro, which lasts till Saturday. On Friday, it is the beginning of the San Antonio Junior Market Bear Show, and on Saturday, there's OAP Clinic at 9 a.m. in Taylor, Texas. Miss Smith's fashion design class has been working on something really unique. They have been making surgical caps for young surgical patients in New York, and Miss Smith is going to tell us about it and show us some examples. Hi. Today I'm going to tell you a little bit about what my fashion design class has been doing for the last couple of weeks. We heard of a project that needed to be done, a community project, but it's not our community, it's up in New York. There's a hospital in New York called the Galasano Children's Hospital that needed uh, surgical caps for the children to wear when they went into surgery to help them alleviate some stress and things like that. When I talked to my girls in fashion design, they said, let's do it, Miss Smith, and so we started. We began by pre-washing the fabrics that the kids picked out and brought up here, and the kids came up with the pattern, and we cut out the patterns, we had to press the fabrics, we uh, sewed around them, I added elastic to it, and we made, I believe it was 59 surgical caps for children to wear when they're going into surgery and a lot of these killed children have cancer and all sorts of different things so just a community project that my kids decided to jump on the bandwagon with we want to let you know the standalone coordination video will be ready in about a week or so and we have lots of cool shots from the program and there's two new shows happening. The Buckaroo Inquirer has been putting the final touches on their bullying episode with lots of interviews. And we have a cool new DJ show coming out next week. We also want to remind high school students that we have six weeks exams next week and we have the schedules online. Thank you for watching the online video announcements and be sure to check the website given our very busy spring schedule. We hope you have a great week.